Well, Charlotte grinds out a win. It took 11 innings to uh, finally beat Asheville. They're, that was one scrappy team that just never quit all weekend. And uh, Coach Hibbs, kind of your thoughts as you kind of think back through the weekend at, at the amount of grinding that had to be done. But some of the guys really coming through for you when you had to have uh, pitches or had to have it at bat. I only saw half of it today. Yeah. So uh, proud of our effort. Uh, kind of got replays of the game after the game was over with. So, um, you know, again, a, a, a very taxing, very trying weekend for everybody. But our guys kept hanging in there and competing and playing. And our assistant coaches did a good job in my absence of, of managing the game. And and we, we actually do things like that in the fall to try to prepare. Um, and, uh, you know, just proud of the effort. Real good effort today. Now you, you grew up in the Midwest. Once the weather starts turning, how does that affect play at all? I know batters seem to tend to like it when it's warmer. What is that? What happens to a baseball team when it gets 70 and into 80, maybe even to 90 degrees? We're just not getting a feel for that, aren't we? I mean, um, again, it, it's, it's just about trying to prepare the right way. Our guys are used to playing in cold weather. We've been doing that all spring, it seems like. But, uh, you know, I thought Brock threw pretty well tonight or today. I thought, uh, again, the guys just, just hung in there. And we weren't very good yesterday and to bounce back and, and really compete like we did today and score two in the last inning after, you know, Asheville had scored one uh, to come back after a long weekend and, and be able to do that. That's, that's a pretty special thing. So, uh, you know, tomorrow's a, a heavy academic day for our guys and, and hopefully a few of them will find the weight room. Uh, and then also, I uh, got a chance to play again on, on uh, Tuesday. You know, we got Winthrop coming here on Tuesday and, and hopefully carry the momentum, you know, into Tuesday. And then with weekend not being travel, you can, you've got Thursday to actually have another workout in. So a chance to kind of Wednesday, Thursday, hit the field again and get the team together and work out. Uh, how important is that as you get back into conference play, be able to get things on the field and correct it after whatever happens on Tuesday? And I really didn't answer the weather question too well, yeah. so I'll answer with this. You know, we, we get a chance to – the weather's supposed to be good the next several days and give us a chance to practice, which we talked about before, how important that is. Um, give us a chance to be able to address things and work on things that we need to work on. And, and uh, you know, all that, all that time's important. Uh, all that's important, even not only for our guys that are playing, but for the guys that maybe are red shirt and to try to get them, you know, continue their development process and and just keep addressing the things that we got to address to continue to work our way into being a good team. All right, home again Tuesday. It's a long home stand, and uh, we get, you got uh, I guess five more games of the home stand coming up, and two out of three this weekend, and hopefully that momentum can carry into this week. Thanks, coach. All right, thanks a lot.